We all know that files and documents pile up quickly, which can make it tricky to find something later, especially if you don't recall exactly what you named it or necessarily where you put it. The new search tool in Microsoft Office and Vista can help you find what you're looking for. Say you want to find a spreadsheet for a project called Reconstruction. Click the Start menu button in the bottom left corner and start typing in the search window. You'll notice that even after the first few letters, you'll have a long list of possible results that appear in the results window, containing those first few letters that you've typed in. The more letters you type, the shorter the list becomes. This means even if you can't recall the exact file name, you still get results, which makes it easy to find what you're looking for. The results window will include things like documents, images, even audio and video, provided that the name of the file includes the search term that you've typed. You know you need a spreadsheet created in Excel, so look for Excel extension type documents. If there are still too many options to choose from, or you don't see your file in the window above the search tool, click See All Results. This will open a larger Search Explorer window, and from there, you can click on the Advanced Search drop-down pane. In the Advanced Search screen, you can really narrow things down, eliminate every file type that isn't a spreadsheet. Maybe you know who authored a file, a colleague named Becky, for example. If you enter Becky's name, you can see all of the spreadsheets that she's created. Now your list should be more manageable, but you still not be 100% sure of what you want. You can review a thumbnail of every file at once without opening and closing each one using live icons. This is pretty cool. The preview pane in the layout menu will give you a large view of your file right inside the search explorer. But what happens if you need to find a file that mentions a term? Maybe it's not the name of the file, but it mentions it, and you have no idea what the file is called. This is where Microsoft Office OneNote 2007 comes in. Once you have all of the files related to a project organized and stored in a OneNote notebook, all you need to do is open the search tool and type in your term. If you need to know how much you spent during the reconstruction project on labor, for example, enter that word. OneNote looks for files that have labor in the title, of course, but it will also look within documents for any mention of labor, audio or video files where it appears, and even photos where a text tag on an image says labor. The hyperlinked results appear on the summary pane. Click on the file that you want to see and you're instantly taken to it. If the file you want appears in multiple notebooks, maybe it's a reference that gets used in multiple projects, you can link it to connect to them for easier recall later. You can also link your search results to specific contacts in Office Outlook so you can instantly call up relevant files when you're preparing for a meeting. OneNote helps eliminate wasted time searching through endless files and folders to get the information quicker to you when you need it fast.